Hey guys, doing a uh, got a four wheel drive problem on my 1997 Polaris Explorer two stroke. That's right, it's a Saint your grandpa's four wheeler. But my friend, my friend Travis said his grandpa, his granddad or dad had one. So I, maybe maybe it is your grandpa's four. I don't know. But uh, this will work for for other ones as well. Uh, I think it was the Sportsman. Uh, I've got a Trail Boss outside. I believe it'll work for that as well. But we're gonna show you how to go ahead and it's it's a common problem. A lot of good write-ups on it. Here's a video on it. I hope it helps out. If it does, you wanna buy me lunch? There's a link down below. Uh, thanks a lot. Really appreciate all the support. Thanks, guys. I'm gonna fire it up. Stings, stings manly. Did it break the gear? I got no spinach here. What's the deal? You want to make sure you have power and ground. You want to make sure that you have power on the gray wire, not the red wire. It can be very easily confused here because you have a, a gray and a red. And, you know, I'm used to automotive stuff where, and I can fix anything, but uh, red would typically be your power. So ideally, you'd want to use some, some wire strippers to peel this back a little bit. I didn't have any here at home. So I took my test light. You don't have to start the vehicle to do this. Just put the key on, put your all wheel drive on. You want to try to make good contact on this gray wire here. And so I was able to just pierce through it. And before I checked for ground, I noticed that I didn't have any power and my test light was, was not lighting up nice and bright. So before we check for ground, let's just find out, hey, let's assume it has a good ground. And we'll go ahead and we'll grab part of that harness down here. We'll wiggle it and we'll follow it up. Well, as I followed it up, lo and behold, this is what I find. I'm jiggling it down here. You know, with my, I got my right hand jiggling. I got my left hand feeling. And I find out, hey, no wonder it doesn't work. I got, I got two broke wires. And I thought, if I was a smart man, and I am, I'm going to look and see if I can find two broke wires that are coming out of the little fuse box here. Let's see what we got. So as I was looking for a couple broke wires hanging out, nothing can't you jumped out at me at first. So I followed up the other wheels wires and found where they hooked up. And then sure enough, right by it, there was a broken gray wire and a broken orangish red wire. So we'll hook those bad boys up. And what I did was to test that and make sure that that they're getting power there. Go ahead, and we don't have to start it. Just check what we got here. Boop. As Gizmo would say, light bright, light bright, light bright, light bright. So guys, the place where this should get power from, as we kind of zoom in here, is these two ports here. There's one here and one here. Top one goes to the left front, bottom one goes to the right front. The grounds are right over here. So if you decide you just want to run, you know, a new power and ground setup, uh, those would be your access ports. So the two that I pointed out, one and two, and then second row, one, and then right above it, two. And you can run brand new wires if you want. I'm going to go ahead and solder these up. Uh, you need information on how to solder, click one of the links down below. I'll show you how real badass is solder. You'll see what I'm talking about. All right, let's see what we got. As the crow would say, fire it up. Fire it up! Might be a little bit before you guys' time. All right, let's see what we got. Ready? Oh, yeah! Check it out. Four-wheel drive. Looks like we got all four wheels spinning. Time to bust the tires loose and cruise around the neighborhood. Come on, kids! You guys ready? Yeah. Let's hop on. Okay, I'm just gonna... All right, who's up front? Easton. Nugget. Yeah? Solid man says you're up front. Nugget, that word. <laughs> I'm just gonna... Hey, I love being your dad. 
Oh, I just did you good Okay, hey, Dad. Yeah, watch out, don't kiss. Later, I'm gonna put a red thing on the carpet, and then it'll be a nightmare. Hop up here. Come on, let's go. Let's go for a little ride. A little test drive to verify the repair. Hop up there, Sally. It looks like the Knight Rider car. A little bit. All right, my number one guys. You guys ready? Make sure it's not too long because I have a pull in my pants. All right, we won't go too long, all right? Okay. You ready to fire it up? Sure. Turn the key on. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. Lord, please keep us safe. Thank you so much for letting me be swift and swift.